Hi everyone, this is the third lesson for um, the Graphs and Networks 2 pack and it's about Chinese posting. Uh, but the other ones we did just had four odds, but if you look at this one, if we just count the odds, see if this works, it doesn't work in a minute again. If we look, we've got six odds. Now generally what they'll do is, they'll set two as the start, finish, and then I've just got four, which is just like a normal question for us. So let's see if this is what this does. So we've got a night watchman on patrol, it's got to wander around all the different corridors and rooms. So it's night watchman starts at point A and can choose from either point C or point F. Right, so A and C or F are all odds. So then the rest of it is evens. All right, so if I've got my odds, which we know are A, B, C, E, F, G, if I start at A, I could finish at F. No, I don't finish. Where am I finishing? Uh, finish at C or finish at F. So if I finish at C, my odds are B, E, F, G. So my pairings are B, E, it's not working. <laughs> Here we go. B, E with F, G, or B, F with E, G, uh, or F, G, sorry, I um, um, or B, G, with E, F. I've actually nicked Barney's room this morning, so I'm trying to rush this to get it done before he gets in. So, for finishing at F, the odds will be B, C, E, and G. So I've got B, C, with E, G, and I've B, E, with C, G, and I've B, G, with, oh no, one. Yeah, what? Well, we'll see it. There you go. If I use the completed pack, B E with F G is forty is a uh, is twenty and twenty five, so which gives forty five. B F with G E is twenty nine and fifteen, which gives forty four. And B G with F E is twenty one and fifteen. Which gives 36. So this one is clearly, if I'm using A to C, the best one, the best repeats is that one. So let's have a quick double check at this one then right? for B, C, E, and G. So B, C to E, G is 18 and 15, so that's 33. B, E with C, G is 20 and 36, so that's 56. And B, G with C, E is 21 and 26, which is 47. So if I'm doing from A to F, my best one is there. So which one is best overall? It's start at A, finish at F. Um, I'm gonna repeat. So B to C is direct, so that's okay. But E to G is E to A and A to G. Remember, you have to have a different ones. And the solution to that will be the 154 plus the 33 to give us 187 minutes. There you go. There. Whew. So that's part A done. Part B says there's an additional road joining B to F directly. So let me just make it easy for you to see. So I've got an additional road there from B to F. Right. So the night watchman realises that after the addition of the extra road, the minimum time traversed to all the roads, if he was to start at A and end at C, is reduced by twice the time 
It needs to traverse the new road. So if I call that X. Right. Okay. Then the new minimum time will be. So it'll be so minimum time. It would be 190. So it's going to be the 154 plus the 36. Because if I add B to F now, let's see, then I've made these even. So my odds now are A, E, G, and C. So now I've got A, E, G, C. There's my odds. So looking at the pairings now, so that's going to be this one that I'm adding in for a pairing. So that's where this one's coming from. So that's going to give me 190, but that time is reduced by twice the time it takes to get from B to F. So actually, the time is 190 minus 2X. So we all came with this one. So because we've added the B to F, it means that AE G and C are, um, are odd. There. So it means that 36 is the smallest repeat that I'm adding in. So it gives me 190, but then it says the time's 2 not 2x off it. Right? Okay, but the time now, so then the total time, uh, hang on. So the total time is 154. So the total for the network. Is 154 plus x there. Uh, so now, if I look, we're going to need to add in. Now, we're going to add in g to e, I think. So I'm still starting at a and finishing at c, aren't I? Yeah, so I'm starting at a, finishing at c. So all we need to do is add in E to G. So I need to add in E G as a start finish. As I need to see. That's the only one I've got left now, E to G. So that'd be 154 plus X plus E to G, which was what was E to G? 15. So that's 169 plus X. Now they're they're the same as each other. The 169 plus x is the same as the 190 minus 2x. If I do some rearranging, what have we got there? So I'll take that away. That's going to be 21. So it gives me x is 7 minutes. There's a lot in that. I'm not entirely certain how long I've described it, to be honest. But let's find out. I've added in the x. Uh, and I'm starting at a and c. Here's a modern repeating g t. I think, I'm hoping that that'll make sense. Anyway, have a go at that. Have a go at the, um, the consolidation. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.